Hi, and welcome back to the Delinquents Podcast. Um, today, it is actually kind of special. We have uh, Gaston here with us. Mm. And it's just he and I today. So, um, just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Ooh, child. Um, so this should be basically a five minute episode. Um, <laughs> right. <laughs> I have zero pepper. <laughs> but, uh, no, this will be fun. I mean, um, I mean, I kind of just wanted yeah, yeah, to, yeah, yeah. uh, I kind of just wanted to talk about basically, I mean, you're starting to get more into, uh, you're getting more into YouTube now. I mean, I know you were a little bit before, like if you go on gas and channel, which you should, if you haven't, uh, like and subscribe. Like and subscribe, shameless plug right there. Um, yeah, <laughs> didn't even say you... the name of the channel, but that's all right. <laughs> Gaston, Gaston Bros. There you go. See, look, I got you. I got you, homie. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, but if you haven't subscribed, you should 100% go uh, and check out his channel. It's nice. great. You just uploaded your latest was Scribbly, right? Yeah, I did like a two parter. I kind of like uh, did. I was editing a lot last night and. Uh was when I finished the Call of Duty one, I posted that one as, like, late as early as I can. Like, I try not to post after midnight, so it was, like, 11.15 or something like that, and then uh, I was just still in the editing bug, so I decided, like, I still have a lot of Scriblio footage, so cut yeah. that up and then put it on. I did what you told me, like, how... Because, like, before, when I was doing it from straight from PlayStation, there was no option to post later. I had to post it right then and there whenever, like, I, quote-unquote, needed to upload it to it. So, but I did the schedule and had it set for this morning at ten fifteen, which is like pretty decent. I like that. Yeah, no, for sure. Yeah, but yeah, that that was that was the latest one I put out, and it's fun being back because yeah, I've been doing it for three years, but let's just say the past two point seven years of it was just like a hobby. Like there was nothing I really. Yeah, that really felt came like from it. To come of it, I just was running out of uh, storage on my PlayStation and wanted to show all my friends who didn't either have that game yet or didn't have a console because a lot of my family and friends don't play video games but they they like watching it and so i kind of like keep that mindset more than anything kind of like rather than other people who already play this game even even though i leave in jokes for them to like certain things like you have to be a fan of this game and this series and this certain specific genre just to like get this one joke that i like laid in there but that's for the true blue amigos the people who who are the the ogs that actually watch yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Out of the thirty-three subscribers I have, woo! I'm immortal. I mean, hey, yeah. it's been the numbers. The numbers have been <laughs> racking up. I have been, I have been uh, watching your progress. I went from twenty-five. I had that for like two point seven years, and I went from thirty-three in the last week. Woo! Hey, there you go, man. That's what's up. I'm doing something right, but yeah, no, it's, I know it's. I, I actually, I have to credit it to the PC that I have now. Straight up. No, I have seen that. That a lot of it's been coming from playing on the PC so much editing like i now that i actually bought one you know rather than just using the share factory no no knock on the share factory you know that guy he's still able to produce pretty good stuff but not to like my fullest like desires because mm, there was just some you. memes that i wanted to put in there or soundtracks or certain editing like effects that just weren't available to me but now they are so that's why oh, your, yeah, your yeah, content yeah. is just booming well thank you sir i take i took like advice from a couple of people like you mm-hmm. and like Neebs and all them. Like, you know, I just like decided like, you know, they, they actually put time and effort into their videos. And, oh, yeah, so. for sure, man. Uh, but that's Make awesome. Make sure to, to like and subscribe to Ryan's channel. It's, uh, I don't Shameless. know how to pronounce it. But Shameless it plug. A-H. No, I, I changed, <laughs> Chlorian, Cologne. I, I changed it back Chlorian. to uh, Delta Dark Frost. Believe oh, okay. Right. Delta Dark Frost. Like and subscribe. Yeah, I changed it back because I was like, you know, this just, this just isn't working. Uh <laughs> i'm sorry I, i'm I'm, a, I'm an uneducated plebeian i just didn't know how to pronounce it it's okay I, for, I forgive you i forgive you my son i forgive you but yeah no man i noticed you've been posting a lot too like i mean you've always were kind of steady but like i noticed an influx in that like they're actually like yeah, i actually no for sure i've always enjoyed watching your videos from the get-go even from like when we first met and like i was like in one of your fortnite videos when we first started playing fortnite when it very first came out and yeah, yeah. I, I still laugh my ass off watching that no, yeah, I remember. Uh, I remember playing uh, some of like the older matches. Ugh, I'm trying to think of what it was. We were playing with uh, Zombie was one of the ones that we were doing for sure, and it would either fluctuate between Shane Jackson, 
Mm-hmm. And so I, I always really enjoyed uh, doing some of those because it was like it was always something fresh with us. Mm. Uh, but I didn't, I didn't always put something out. So it was, it was so inconsistent with like my uploading was so just all over the place, but, yep. um, but now, yeah, I've gotten into more of the swing of things. Like I have, uh, right now I have a air quote schedule. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's Same. a big air quote. Um, but it's like Mondays is what I'm is what I'm finding works. Is I go Mondays, I do uh, my actual video that I want to put out, and then I have uh, what's it called? I have our podcast that we put out on Thursdays. So mm-hmm. kind of gives a little sum sum for everyone to hold on to until uh, the next day comes or the next week or the uh, next Monster Hunter Monday. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I miss this one, God. <laughs> Darn it, man. It was because that Star Citizen video took me forever. It was like my, my baby project. I was starting to fall in love with it. Yeah, no, I, actually, I... It just I, took me too many days to make that, and I, I, it, I posted it on dang Monday when I should have posted Monster Hunt. I'm sorry, folks. I let you down. I let gosh, you, down. you should all just unsubscribe. I just I just need to need to quit. I need to, I need to go take a sabbatical. And get you, my you need to go quit together. YouTube. Jesus. I need Terrible. to get my shit together. Um, no, I actually thoroughly enjoyed the... Uh, the what, what's the star something what is it called citizen well thank star you citizen. good sir i yeah. appreciate it. you're gonna like this one i i got a i went on to um what you call it one of those star wars crawler things where you can make one of the those openings where the letters go up across the screen and shit oh yeah yeah, yeah. it's yeah, the yeah, uh, yeah, star so wars I, crawl i don't i think there's like an official name for it but i have mm-hmm. you would think that i would know this as a star wars fan but i don't well, I there were several ones. I there was that one that's the mainstream one, and then I picked one that where you would have to either wait to download it, like, and you would put in a quote unquote queue, and that queue was gonna make me wait like two hundred and something days, or you could donate from to up to fifty dollars to speed up your process. What? That's they horrible. allow you to, <laughs> yeah, that's stupid, but they allow you to, uh, uh what you call it, uh, view it beforehand, right? And so I just mm-hmm. did my little screen recorder, and the only hook is that. In the middle of it, there's one phrase, like three le- three words that kind of blink a little. So it looks like they're like those three letters are having a spaz attack for a second, but then they correct themselves. And I guess that's just like like their quote unquote watermark. So like people don't like people who are nitpicky, but they didn't depend on my laziness. <laughs> I don't give two fucks. It's only for like three seconds. Hell, I'll even edit and be like, "Yep, this is because I got the free version." I'll I'll say that. I don't give a damn. Put it in the actual title. Yeah, that's right. awesome. No, I totally get it. Um, but yeah, you're gonna like it. I love it. I'm gonna put a lot of Star Wars memes in this one, like uh, the oh, this is where the fun begins, and then flying's for droids. See, I feel like uh, the the Star Wars community is missing out on your videos. See, it's, mm-hmm. it's good quality stuff, and they're just like Star Citizen is so much like it. Sorry, continue. I'm, I, no, you're I, good. <laughs> no, like what's so? I don't I don't know anything. It's it's a PC game, right? Mm. It's an alpha too, so it's not really a game game just yet. But you can still buy things to like play it and test it out no for sure there's a lot of alpha things coming out like i had talked to you about uh there was an avatar game that was being made on dreams on ps4 mm. and it looks I've, uh... I've kept up with the guy's progress and i was like oh this actually looks pretty good like this guy's put some effort into it uh it doesn't look like a potato so i was thinking about it but there's so many games like that that are that are out now yeah, and is it is it going to be an alpha state or is it just one of those, uh, like like in terms of um, alpha only the a select few get to play it or test it out? I'm not sure. I, I've been curious about that. I I posted something on the guy has videos that he's been posting, and I had uh, I'd been commenting on them, but I hadn't been uh, commented back, so I'm pretty upset about that. <laughs> but uh, but no, I'm pretty sure it's going to be. It's going to be open beta, I think, when he finally puts it out. Oh, okay. I see. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. That's cool. Because, like, you know how some games, like, they go in development, and then they'll let you play either the alpha for a very short time or only, like, one instance of it, and then the same thing, they'll take it away, then come back with a beta, or they never even let you try the alpha, they only let you try the beta. Or some games don't even have that, and they just let you, they just come out with it. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. But this one specific. Uh, particularly has been in alpha for about 10 years oh really yeah so it, it was a concept a long time ago in 2012 and they had a kickstarter for it and then it finally like came into fruition around 2013 
and they made the game, but it was literally all you could do was walk in a hangar and look at your ships. You couldn't even fly the damn ships. Oh, in the so beginning. they were just like, yeah, so we have this game, mm-hmm. but you can't play it yet. You got to back it up or like, you know, like we, we we're giving it to the community and the more money you get, the more we can start building up this game. And so like they had a goal mm. of like a couple million, but they've gotten exceedingly amount. They have, they've already earned 300 million past uh, 10 oh, really? years. And they, yeah. And then like, or, I mean, I'm not too concerned about the time length because other official games like Anthem took like 10 years to make and that one sank and that was by ea like they had a whole company backing them and then diablo 3 a lot of like a big game that everybody loves that took over a decade to make but it was made in secret like you couldn't play the alpha or the beta because they didn't need you to because they had a big company that could pay for everything yeah and they already had a company that made diablo 1 and 2 so this is like a company starting from the ground up and to be honest i forgot it's from robert it's robert space industries it's like the um logo of the people the game developers i guess and it's by this guy robert something i'm sorry i'm disgracing him right now but he's like honestly on the level of steve jobs and all that in terms of like innovation and technology and like a vision oh really yeah and that's why i was really attuned to this game i mean i'm not gonna say it's the best game i've ever played because it's still alpha so it doesn't have a lot of things that a full game needs like obviously every time it has a patch when they add something or fix a bug your whole progression gets wiped except for the things that you purchase with real money so oh I mean, no that's kind of whack yeah so like in a month or two like everything i bought like if i like you know spent like a day or two grinding mining stuff and bought a ship or whatever that's gone or whatever but if i bought that ship with real money i could keep it <laughs> but if you spend real cash yeah then i bought the game it. package like they have two less packages for like or not less what the heck? that's not even a phrase they have two basic packages which are like $45 each, and that gives you, like, because you have to buy a ship in order to buy the quote-unquote game, and so the cheapest ship they'll let you buy is $30, and combined with the game is 15 it's like $45, and then from then on, like, every ship adds on to that, and like, you can straight up buy a game package, it's worth $275, so the ship is worth 260 like, hmm. what the hell? Yeah, that's a little whack, I mean, there was, what was the game, it was called, uh, Eli sort of played it, uh, it was called Cube World, Oh, I heard about that. Yeah, so he convinced me to get Cube World. And so I was like, all right, I'll get it, no big deal. And then the game was just like, you could pay to do certain things, but it wasn't worth it in a way. And, and But there was a lot of other things that were wrong with, with that game. But yeah. uh, that, was just, that was just one of them. Was it a free game or did you have to buy it? No, you had to buy it. Oh damn! Yep, mm. you had to buy it. So oh, I was like, okay. "Oof!" So you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, but it was. I mean, it was still. It was a cool game, and I know that there was. Uh, there was a different. Not. There was a an, an original version of Cube World. I never got to play it, but you know, it's not mm. that big of a deal. But I heard that was much better than. Uh, much better than this. The new industrialized one, the modernized one, just yes, ruined it. Precisely. <laughs> I was like, oof. Um, but oof, oof. Uh, but oof. cool, man. I mean, yeah, it, it's cool to see you doing some more videos, and it's it's nice to see them coming out because it's it's such different content than uh, like what I've had in the past. And I mean, even looking at some of the older videos that you had. Your content now is is a little different. Your editing is a little yeah. different. Yeah, like I said, because before when it was a hobby, all I really did was wanted to get cool clips, so I just mashed them up to the montages. And most of the time, there was either very dirty audio, like uh, like saying too many curse words and profanities, or uh, just no audio at all, or the audio just didn't match up with the gameplay. So that's why just tons of music in the background, just badass montage clips, and no real content other than just like I guess cool clips. I guess. Mm-hmm. No, I get it. Totally. Um, now I want to like go more on the comedic side because it's, it's easy. I find that comedy comes so easy. Like I can insert a meme there, or just come up with a joke on the fly or a pun. I, I'm a, I'm a master and, and a sucker for puns. Like if you tell me a good pun, I'm just on the floor laughing. No. Yeah, for sure. I've, I've come to realize that over time. <laughs> like you guys could tell me the most sophisticated joke that would make, but then like you just tell me like a stupid pun joke and I'm over here. <laughs> um no i did 
I did watch your your like I said the Scriblio video. Just watching that, there was there was so many good like little oh, yeah. and stuff dropped in in those videos. Um, well, you guys and the bros give good content. I know we're just piece, we're just all just such special people. Shout out to Zombie real quick. I couldn't use any of his because either one they were too inappropriate, uh, too too personal, and uh, three or B whatever one you want to go with. Um, your stupid AK forty seven mic thing was going in the background. I know. Oh, I was trying to f- listen. I was trying to listen for it when uh when I watched it, and I was like, where where is this AK forty seven they're talking about? But you, you know, know what I did after I realized I, f- I forgot I could just split the audio and turn that down. So, like, we might not hear a joke or two, but, like, we won't hear. You won't hear. Because sometimes it doesn't last too long. It only lasts for, like, three or four seconds. But No, I gotcha. So next, the next one, because I still have a good – I have another one that's a 42-minute long clip. Just that clip itself. I haven't even edited it. I got to okay. go through that. Okay, big facts. I got you. Probably got some good ones in there. Big man over here. Um, and then, no, dude, sure. like your videos, I like the effects and the time that you put into them because, like, the green screen and like you have like really good timing. And no, for whatnot. sure, yeah. And then, thanks, man. Not to mention, I you since you do that rule about the whole I'm gonna mute other people, you know, involved because I tend to not do that in my audio gets fucked up. No, yeah. So the problem is, is I find that when I do it, then it's just so much easier to do the recording. Yeah, uh, it, may, and, it may be like, oh, sorry, I can't talk to you for ten minutes, but it's like, eh, this is my hobby. Yeah, it's worth it when you when you when you think about it because you're like, oh, uh, yeah, like y'all are talking, and uh, y'all are saying some no no words that uh, I I can't I can't have on here. I'm gonna you know not, I'm, I'm gonna get demonetized up in. Yeah, exactly. Um, but no, nah, it was. I mean, you you live and you learn. There's so many things that I was just like. I didn't realize before that after I, like, saw them that I was like, oh, yeah, I kind of don't want to do that. Uh, that doesn't that doesn't look good, you know. And then it's all kind of figuring out who you are. Yeah, that is true. Cause like I'm still feeling like a baby bird that can't fly out of the nest just yet. I'm, I haven't figured out where I want to go or what I want to do with it. Because there's that whole thing of becoming. Like, careful what you wish for, actually becoming popular and stuff, because right now YouTube's not very, uh, you know, forgiving to its content creators. Like, there's a lot of trolls out there that try to get your footage flagged or taken down because of a word or because, quote-unquote, you're using their footage when you're really not. And it takes, like, YouTube three months for you to, like, get your footage back on there just so they can prove that it's your footage, quote-unquote. Yeah, no, I know. It's, it's kind of It's kind of whack. Uh, and then you got a comment section and dislikes and all that stuff. And I don't take criticism well. Um, I just want to live in my bubble. You just want to live in your bubble. <laughs> Where nothing bad happens and no one's mean to me. <laughs> I, I feel that on an emotional level. <laughs> I, I really do. I no, really I mean, do. I can take it. Like, I really do appreciate, like, because, like, people like Austin and Volmer and Shane are really honest with me about like nah that wasn't funny or oh, your audio was way too loud or not loud or blah, blah 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 and it's like yes okay good i need that feedback because i need to be able to make this video more pleasurable to your eyeballs because like i'll love anything i do because i'm the one fucking i was about to say because you're the one doing it <laughs> yeah, exactly I'm like, look at my baby you'll be like oh this is so funny isn't it funny guys isn't it so oh my funny? god oh my god look at that I didn't even know. And people are like I'm yo so that's proud. not that's not funny at all like what are you, what are you talking about <laughs> i'm like a dad at the softball game like look at my kid run and he's like can't even run and he loses they get they strike him out anyway nah yeah the kid ah, the job, kid is Jeff. your the kid is your hey, video it's my video <laughs> <laughs> he's swinging at the thing on the tee and he's missing it like a hundred times exactly that but that I'm would be like, yeah. that would be my kid no cap right um but yeah i mean it's i mean overall just your your videos have just gotten muy bueno so well, thank you sir I again if you that. haven't if you haven't been and looked you should uh you should go and uh check out his channel you know what i'm saying like and subscribe like and, to like gas and subscribe. And un bros it's n with an apostrophe n i know that doesn't apostrophe. roll off the tongue very well but it does if you say it fast gas and bros Gaston and <laughs> bros, just the end. That's the that's the accent that we all want to hear. Um, kind of like, like I don't know what other analogy to put it with that. 
mm, like like beans and cornbread or something like that. <laughs> to the A or the D. <laughs> Mac and cheese. Mac and t- there Mac. we go. Golly, I had to say big brain place. <laughs> What uh? All right. Well, then let me ask you this. What do you like? Uh, do you have any sneak peeks? Like, do you have ideas that you're gonna have for future episodes, or I mean, uh, videos that you're gonna do? You know. Well, Star Citizen. I know I've been talking a lot about that, and I said a little bit about the second episode, but this one is like, cause like, all my videos have been either montages, random one-time gameplays, and whatnot, because I've never really either a played a game that has like anything that um, progresses it's just more like you know jump in jump out jump in jump out same thing wish wash wish wash but like with a series i wanted to do a series because i tried to do that with arc because that one at least you know you can track your progress from watching and i could do like an episodic type thing where everything rolls one after the other you know picks up where it left off continues where where it left off yada 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 and uh, i just was never able to do that with arc because like we grew way too fast for me to like keep up with the recording and not to mention I got a little lazy with it, but this one, I'm planning on keeping it super, super um, scripted, su- super, super uh, planned out and whatnot, and try to make this into an actual quote unquote series, because that's really what I wanted to do when I first started out, but I eh, just never got around to it. Okay. I yeah, are they so. are they supposedly coming out with any more things for uh for Ark? Uh yeah, there's a new map coming out this uh, February 25th. It's um, oh, they're like they had a season pass for it too. I was like Jesus Christ, even Ark has a season pass. But um, it's uh because there's one coming out this year and one coming out next year supposedly. I mean, we don't know when it is gonna be next year because this first one was supposed to come out like this past Christmas, but they delayed it now until February 25th. Mm-hmm. But yeah, they had like a bunch of new creatures because it's already like you're back on Earth now, you're in space, and we already know the whole. Mm-hmm. story now instead of like us being kidnapped by aliens we were created by a dna machine that our ans- like that our ancestors before us made because they polluted the earth with this element that was like a super fuel and it radiated all these and made these giant creatures that made the earth dead so they had to leave make these like arcs quote unquote that like all hovered around the planet and sustained different batches of life and the only the toughest and strongest like that like would like start to realize like hey we're not really on a planet and like what's going on here and then going through the quote-unquote implemented ai security that we thought was aliens that was just testing us to make sure that we were strong enough to go back down to earth so now that we're back down onto earth there's some crazy creatures on there that have been mutated and so it's not really a dinosaur game kind of like digging it okay i mean that could be kind of fun i see like i mean we even talked about this on a a previous podcast if you haven't, uh, if you haven't listened to our podcasts, then uh, you're kind of gay. Fucking listen to it. Yes, uh, we do it, some... or I'll go to your house and I will tickle you. He will. He he will tickle you, and he will. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh. We talked about that. We all kind of not that we met through Arc, but I mean, it was it was an outlet that we all kind of became closer through. Like when I when I first joined, Arc was one of the first games that uh, I played with you guys. Mm-hmm. So. I was like, oh my god, this is I love this game, it's so much fun. Uh but we haven't played it probably since then, to be honest. Yeah, at least not you. Oh yeah, sure. that's for sure. Have you have you played it? Yeah, uh, not too long ago, um Alex had a uh private server. Oh wow. Cuz I had one for even longer than that, like yeah, before that. Yeah, I re- I remember that one. I remember So that you server. played on that one, right? Correct? Yes, I did. I played on that server. Okay. Cause we hopped around on that one too. Like, like we played on the f- new free one. That's what got everybody back into it was that it was a new map and it was free for everyone. No one had to like buy DLC or anything. So everyone was like, yeah, cool. We could all play this. Like Jax, Eli, you, me, Alex, um, Shane and zombie. And it, we had a couple more people playing with time. Um, so I was, that's when I was like, you know what? I, think i can get definitely get us a server i can i looked up did my research it was like only 13 dollars a month I was like, okay fine sure. <laughs> okay <laughs> that's that's nothing so i and then that, that was the best decision because i will never ever ever go to vanilla straight up multiplayer ever because that community is way too toxic i don't like it you can't yeah. even enjoy the game that's what it seemed like to me i i didn't it didn't really seem to be that fun 
Well, it, it, it like well now it's like even so. Say you just started up the game right, now and you mm-hmm. went online, and and this is on any server like PC, PlayStation, or Xbox, and you just log into a random server, right? That's PVE because you don't want to be in a PVP right now. You don't want to have to deal with others, and um, you know you want to pick like the newest, coolest map, or maybe even the the first map so you can just get used to it, right? No matter what map you pick, no matter what server you pick. It's either going to be overpopulated and or run by an alpha tribe. Hmm. And what they do is they straight up, since you can't kill anybody or hurt anybody in PvE, they just build everywhere. And I'm talking every um, – for your player, I want to say every 10 yards, there's a there's a damn pillar somewhere that they, put, that they just put there. Because pillars don't uh, like block spawning things, so like rocks and trees will still spawn around pillars. But – in PVE to prevent, like, um, since you can't kill anybody, you can't build near anybody. And so they own the map, basically. You can't you can't even make a damn campfire to keep yourself alive. To even try to think of where you want to um, build a hut. And if you even do have, like, a little tiny bit of square land, it's probably the, the worst piece of property anywhere. And then, not to mention, it just takes away from the immersion of the game. It's like you're no longer in a forest or in a, in a valley or in a thing. You just see pillars. It's ridiculous. It makes the game lag super hard. And then if you go to PvP, oh my goodness, like you have people that are just like so territorial that like, oh yeah, we wipe the server daily by the way. come around with our biggest creatures, break every kill every if yeah, you're not a part a, of our tribe. That's that's a Oh, little can whack. I be a part of your tribe? No, we don't want a new member. Fuck. What would I do? Leave this server. Thanks, so don't ever don't ever open up the chat in PvP. Yeah. That mm-hmm. that sounds a little uh sounds a little whack. So I mean a private server where like, you know, it's con- people like you know okay this guy's a, a trickster and we allow that because we love him and this guys are, like we, we we can control it and stuff like that. yeah i gotcha so that's why i'll never go back to it. i mean with this new map uh alex and i were kind of wanting to we'll probably split it this time because he bought it he bought one this past couple of months and a half for like a month and a half but we just weren't playing it as much i was super busy shane was super busy yeah, yeah i gotcha uh, Alex was super busy, so we never really even got to play together at the same time. There was only three of us, so that's kind of like my deciding factor, too. I want there to be at least more than two of us. Yeah, no. Three of us is fine, but I mean, the more the merrier. Well, that's what I said about uh, I was going to get a uh, Minecraft server, because I thought it would be fun to to have that. But uh, for one, I couldn't get everyone on board. But uh, (laughs) I'm going to get it soon. I just... (laughs) I spent a lot of money on this. End no, for sure. I just saw. I saw your. Uh, I saw the numbers of what you said you were spending on your on your PC. I was like, whoa, <laughs> whoa, okay, all right. There. And this year, I'm gonna upgrade it. I got another thousand dollars. Drop into upgrades. Yeah, it is unacceptable. I didn't realize that what I got. Because like when I bought it, I didn't realize it only came with an i5 four process. Yeah, that's unacceptable. If you're that if is... you're if your PC isn't uh, if your PC isn't Pog, then uh, bro, uh, I'm gonna get that new i generate ninth generation i nine 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 X or whatever one that looks like a damn like Dungeons and Dice. They're Dungeons and Dragons dice. Like, mm. Mm. <laughs> I'm I'm already salivating. It's your sal. <laughs> Oh, gross. <laughs> <laughs> that was gross. Don't say that. That's so gross. I'm salivating. He says, look at me, I'm salivating. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. There. Oh, yeah. Um, I mean, honestly, I, I don't really, uh, I mean, I don't really have much else to talk about other than the fact that, uh, you know, you got a bomb channel. You know what I'm saying? Oh, thanks, man. You too. Well, you know that's it's it's my job. We gotta do some more collabing, you know, and like how we collab here on the podcast, like definitely like what we were talking about last night about the uh, sharing footage to get different angles. Now, PC, I can upload it on there and then just send it to you. I know. Look at we can just start, you know, popping out videos. I feel like, like a big boy like now. They're, like they're like they're babies, man. We can just pop them out. <laughs> like rabbits. Saying? Like rabbits. Oh my god. 
Um, okay, cool. I mean, this was kind of a cool little, little episode, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, I have fun. Thanks super, super, uh, thanks for having me. Not like right, that. like, I'm, I didn't go anywhere. <laughs> it's like, like, you're not one of the regular people that come on this podcast. For real, right? Um, I mean, yeah. So it is, it's kind of nice to have you on. I mean, it's, it's a nice break away from what we normally do. Um, Ugh, I hate those other guys now that they're not here. I know, we can finally let loose and just <laughs> say it, man. We can just preach, preach to the choir, you know what I'm saying? I mean, Shane is just too damn sexy. I can't, I mean, he's I can't just, handle it. He just distracts me with his with, with his sexiness. And then you can put Alex right on board with that, with his soothing baritone voice. Just oh, like, he does, hey, he does, he does doing? have that soothing baritone voice, my friend. Um, like, he could lie. just be like, hey, I'm going to put a be like, Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Um, cool. Well, I guess zombie. Just... I love like a son. He is. I, I hate him like a son. <laughs> I have a, I have a video out. Uh, that I called him was like, it's uh, f- frick. I did uh, I did one of them on Fortnite. It was uh, COD with my son, or it was like uh something with my son. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure it was um a uh, Fortnite. It was Apex Fortnite. Yeah. Are you oh, sure? I, yeah, I could have sworn it was Fortnite. I'll go back and look. Yeah, we'll have we'll have to we'll have to do a double check, but uh, yeah, I've, I've, I've tune won, in next week to find I've one hundred percent called him my son on in yep. a, in, a, in a video. <laughs> um, so I just want to guide him and guide him and teach him teach, teach him, him the ways my ways my ways not the ways my ways no the way it is the there's way. no the way there's my way or the highway oh it's your way or the highway all right son you think and you then, think you think you own this this thing we're doing right now no. i don't think so That's i own I mean. everything what are you talking about i own everything what do you mean not just this thing i'd have to clarify um cool well i mean that's pretty much it i guess we can kind of i just... didn't get to talk shit about Jax or eli Jax with his ah! <laughs> awesome gnarly living <laughs> life to the fullest ass having a great time doing awesome shit in school having a blast yeah he seems they, they all seem to be having fun you know and then Eli over here just being responsible. Fucking Eli, man. Fucking yeah. working, taking working. care of his family, just being a John, honest Joe. You know what I mean? I hate people. Honestly, man, people that people that are that are good people are just the worst. Am I right? You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, and he's really good, so he's just yeah. Terrible. He's just God. He is just he's, he's just terrible. terrible. He is terrible. <laughs> he is terrible. Um, cool. Austin talks a mile a minute he's like an auctioneer <sighs> he does he's so fast like you can't even understand him you know what nope. i'm saying no <laughs> no austin you're you're a good guy you're, you're a good guy austin dude. you're a good guy dude no you, you're you're always full of energy in a good way because you know that that brings it to our what you call it my over i'm tired for gas you know you, you pet me up you're like my morning con Uh, you know the mood bounce bow wow no <laughs> like the pornhub thing boom to steam um cool i mean i How do you know what that sounds like i don't uh, um hi uh, thank you for watching the podcast um, <laughs> <laughs> um, ooh. Peace. um but yeah thank you guys for watching uh, we really appreciate it or listening depending on what you're listening on because we are on uh apple podcasts apple podcasts that's what it is apple podcasts spotify and on youtube so definitely be sure but to I check have that an out Android. <laughs> well too freaking bad uh and be sure to check out uh gasson's channel uh, there's a lot of great content on there and if if you haven't watched it then you're 100 percent missing out on some really great things so make sure you. to watch delta dark frost channel yes delta delta dark of the forest uh so yeah thank you guys oh frost frost shut the fuck up <laughs>